Hi, my name is Dr. Gloria Ospina. I practice in Coray Gables, Florida since 1992. And uh, I am here today just to answer some questions about um, cosmetic dentistry and my practice, um, the new technology that I have implemented. The reason why I got my patent um, was because I have a deep passion for what I do and, and I really uh, think of the patient's expectations. So for instance, a patient come to my office and, and say, I don't like my smile, I hate it, I can't smile, I delete all the photos when I smile and I'm like, oh my god. So, so I just won't say usually I show too much gum and my lip disappears under my nose and my teeth are too short. So I am like, okay, so uh, the traditional way of doing this um, before, like we can only approach just the gum line, we can reduce the length and the length of the teeth and increase the gum line. And, and just move the, the, the smile higher or and do porcelain veneers if the reduction is a lot. But um, one day a patient told me, hey, doctor, I want you to correct this, but I don't want you to touch my gum line. So I had that for a long time in my brain and, and I said I need to, because this was a, the first time that patient were asking me and I would um, I was intrigued like I have to come up with something and I started doing my research and starting the anatomy and and basically I put a technique and I did it on on my first patient and and actually it went really well and and then I had other ideas and I kept improving my technique. So what I basically did was just to to lower the lip, so patients they just they smile and the and the lip won't go too high uh, and disappear on under the nose. Uh, so uh, there's different approaches that I that I do. Um, I remove a piece of uh, the tissue under the lip and I then I separate the muscle and. and and attach the the the, the lip um, to the to the gum and lower so the the lip is, is lower. But also there's some cases that I have to remove bone. Sometimes I remove it uh, prior to the the low the, the lip surgery, or sometimes I do it at the same time. And also um, I do place Botox uh, the day of the surgery because I need to protect my stitches. So when the patient is smiling and and they are, um, they usually they're not careful because when you smile, you just smile spontaneously. You don't have to be aware of like, I cannot smile, you need to hold your lip down because I have stitches. So um, placing Botox, it was the solution and, and then I put the, the method and then I really, uh, I got very good results and my patient was super happy and then um, just uh, I applied for, for a patent in the United States and I'm really happy now. Thank you very much for watching this video today. If you have any questions, so please call the office at 305-443-8225 or you can visit us at www.cosmeticdentistrymiami.com.